right ingredients. Prepared with love. A perfect combination, like you and Pick and Pay. So everyone's been trying to find my eggs because it's Easter and I thought I'd pop into the Espresso studio to uh, find an egg. This is actually quite a big, decent egg there, Zola. Where did you find this? <laughs> you, okay, all right. Pick and pay. Theo, do you know where, where that egg was found? No, you don't. You don't. Okay, but that's not really important right now because we're, we're going to be showing you friends at home to make a nice little delicious recipe using hot cross buns. Are those nachis? Yes. I like nachis are good. Nachis are good. They're miniolas, actually. Yeah. And, and, close and, enough. and some lovely, lovely pomelade custard. There's some orange flavored jelly. Yes, which we've made here already. Who doesn't like jelly? Who doesn't? You know. Even what the are we Easter making? Bunny What's this called? We're making a trifle. Yes. It's a hot cross bun trifle. Well, let's see. Let's <laughs> yeah, get going. Yeah, yeah, yeah no, sorry. No, no, they, I forgot to pin them back. <laughs> okay, cool. Well, let's get making them, yes? Okay. So, what we're going to do is Theo's going to start us off with by ripping the um, hot cross buns and putting them at the bottom. You know how with, with trifle, you usually put sponge cake? Yes. Because it's it's Easter, we've got tons of hot cross buns, mm -hmm. so we're going to use them instead. Are these fresh? Fresh. Fresh. Like oh, freshly yeah. baked. Mmm. Wow, these are really good. Uh, Theo, help. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'll do uh, okay. in the meantime. Here we go. So then, you, we've already made some um, orange flavoured jelly. You can just mm -hmm. go and buy the pick and pay orange jelly and then make it according to the packet instructions. Yes. Okay. Then, Theo, you're going to zest the Nashi. the miniola into the what? <laughs> into this is a miniola. So it's not a nachi. Yeah, no. It's a miniola. Okay, cool. Okay, so zest. Don't zest, get your fingers finger. fingernails. It's one, two, three, turn. One, two, three, turn. There you go. So you just want the orange bit like mm -hmm. that, yes. That was five. One, two, three. Go. <laughs> one, two, Three, turn. One. There we go, Mr. Theo. Okay, wait, I want to know about this. A miniola. Yes. Well, how it's does like it differ a from cross an arcade? between a nachi and an orange. So it's almost like a mini zola. No, no, no a mini miniola. Yola. But how did they get it right? Did they take like half of a nachi gene and then splice it into the half of an orange gene and plant it in? Oh, oh, mini yola. I, I wish I knew. Man. If you do you know, friends? If if you know, let us know. Okay, how did they discover the miniola? The Kay. cross between a nachi and an orange. Okay. Okay, so pass that one to, to Theo so you can do the same. There you See, go. it's yeah. got like bigger segments than a than a nachi. Yes. And they but are, smaller are they than as an easily orange, removable. They are completely. Ah. It's, it's it's got the peelableness of a nachi. Yes. Okay. So while Theo does that, I'm going to squeeze the juice in. Wow. Because you Making... know, in a, in a traditional trifle, you sort of soak the sponge in in booze. But this is it's Easter, and we we got children. So we use this instead. Yes, oh, you, 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 you did just say that, didn't you? What I, I wasn't. Uh, yes, okay. What? what? No, if you missed it, it's a good thing. <laughs> okay. Theo, how are we doing there? Need some help. You, okay, let me help you. Here we go. Let me help you. Okay, okay while I do this, mm -hmm. um, Theo, spo start spooning some jelly, because now it's it's a trifle, so you know how you you layer a trifle? Yes. So we've got some oranginess, nachiness, miniolaness happening. Oh, I can't wait for the custardness. Yeah, yes. You know, inside. how yeah. awesome so is that going to be? So you want to layer it so that you can see it on the side because it's all about the beauty of the end product. Ah, it? yes. Yeah. Tell me, um, how long do you let jelly set for? Um, or do you let it sit until it sets? Now, you know that if you make jelly according to packet instructions, you, put, you dissolve it in hot water, right? Yes. And then you put in cold water, and then you put that in the fridge, and you set it. It takes about what, ten minutes, fifteen okay. minutes, depending on how cold your fridge is. Mm -hmm. But if you want to speed it up, you can actually, instead of the cold water, put ice cubes in it. Oh, and as yeah. the ice cubes melt, you'll see it actually setting, setting already. in front of you. Wow! So you can use it straight away. Fear, did you know that? Because I mean, we just eat custard and jelly for dessert. We don't really know how it how it gets made, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. But now we do. Man. So you can you can use whatever jelly you want, obviously. Uh -huh. I think um, orange is festive. Okay, sc scrape while I hold it for you. There we go. Oi! Nicely. That looks very nice. It smells great. Doesn't it? It smells all orangey and citrusy and... And miniola li li Miniola-y. Miniola-y. Okay, give you a hand there, Theo. Okay. Yeah. There So how's it looking on the side? Are we going to be doing something with the with the chocolate Easter egg? Yes, we are. Of okay, we are. Okay, great, great. Okay, right. so next we go custard. Custard. Here we go, Theo. Theo, get busy. Us. It matches your shirt. Yeah, you can see SpongeBob slowly disappearing there behind the custard. Nice. There you go. 
You can never have too much custard, friends. I, I believe you can agree. just go, just keep going, keep going like until you, just said, you can never have enough. Keep going. Till the cows come home. The whole thing. There we go. Why not? Mm -hmm. so it's Easter. Celebrate. Just for those friends who have just tuned in, what are we making again? We're making a hot cross bun trifle. Hot cross bun trifle. And the, the Easter bunny has come in to join the fray here. Yeah, okay. Because hot cross buns are... Now, Easter bunny, give us your egg. Oh. Now, for a try, you can top this with cream, um, but I don't think it's necessary because you've got... I mean, why ruin it with cream? Yes. Well, or, or you can. I mean, it's up to you. Mm, but let's, let's stick with our recipe. For yeah, now. okay. So now, you've got leftover Easter eggs because you've done your hunt. Mm -hmm. What do you do with them? <laughs> add them to the truffle. Yes, yeah. just add them to the truffle. Yeah. To the trifle. Okay. There we go. Here we go. We all smash. Get busy there, Mr. Theo. Smash and add. Oh, man. Smash and add. And when you dish it up, you're just going to dig through all oh, of those you know, layers, take you know. one huge scoop of everything and plonk onto your plate. You know it. Ah, oh, yes. Cat. Trifle is such. Oh, and look, is such so a easy. You can leave it, let it soak some more. Look, look, all the layers, fab. Beautiful. Okay. SMS the keyword TRIFLE to 33728 to get the ingredients to this recipe sent to your phone. Yeah, so why did you dish for us? There we go. Get to the... Wait, wait, okay. <laughs> <laughs> let me... Let me... Let me you got to start at the corner. Yeah, exactly. There we go. And then you got to put your spoon all the way down. All the way down. Down. Get, down get there. Here the bottom. Get there, my Clink. son. Okay, and go, now go. scoop towards yourself. Yes, Theo. Take get it all in. Everything. Go quickly. <laughs> There you go. One more time. Now listen, when you dish trifle, it's not pretty. It's, yes. It's pretty in the bowl, uh -huh. but when you start eating it... It's supposed to be it, a messy it, business. Exactly. There we go. Let me give you a hand. We just need a bit, a bit of... There we go. Oh, yeah. you can see Mama Zola's been doing this for a long time, eh? Who is Mama am I? Hello? <laughs> <laughs> Hello. <laughs> Nobody's Mama here. All right, right, right. I just need to, get, need to get ready for this. Yeah. Get, get the ears all pinned back. Move your ears. Makeup! Hair pins, please, for the... All right. Here we go. Okay. Taste it and let me know. Cancer, will it's you so please pretty. oblige us? Get a piece of get everything. Get a bit of everything. Jelly. Um, yeah. Get a big mouthful. Oh, yes. That is a big mouthful. There's a smile coming up. I can see a smile <laughs> coming up. <laughs> can you believe it? What do you say? Good for Easter. Oh, it's great. It's a great dessert. And I'm going to get in here, get a bit of my Easter egg. Bit of that jelly, the miniola soaked hot cross bun. Oh, okay, well, let's see if I can handle this. No, it's gonna be too big, isn't it? You know, Zola's already going, oh my gosh. Mmm. 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 Woo! Beautiful! Beautiful. Mmm. That miniola really kind of adds a little bit of a citrusy zest to it, huh? Exactly. Mm. What chocolatiness, dairiness, awesomeness. It's really, really, really good, friends. Try it out. And hey, if you make this at home, why not take a picture and put it on our Facebook page? Show us what you can do with your trifle. Stay with Espresso and SABC3.